forsaken, banished to eternal sorrow in this city of woe. The omnipotence that raised me here is anything but divine. In my blind and unattaining state, my miserable life has sunk so low that I must envy every other fate. My soul, bound and bent by the thundering voice of omniscience, fruitlessly seeks to know whether any ever frees itself from such imprisonment. Such freedom seems so far off, so far I scarce could see it as the master shoved me back, crying, down, down. My soul in scorn and thinking to be free, my face had paled to a mask of cowardice. Then he embraced me in his graceless grip, saying, Indignant spirit, I kiss you as you frown. So did I tremble at each frightful word. His scolding filled me with that shame that makes the servant brave in the presence of his Lord. Oh, you, exempt from every punishment of this grim world, because of you I lie here in this big pen. I see new torments and new souls and pain about me everywhere. Wherever I turn away from grief, I turn to grief again. Even the cradles are all but empty of suffering sons, silent and weeping like a choir of anguish striking through the tortured air. I lie fixed here, as you see, in the path of all who pass. Here I must feel the weight of all through all eternity. Only those elements time cannot wear were made before me, and beyond time I stand. Abandon all hope, ye who enter here.